Oh, I didn't see you standing there. Sorry. Hey guys, welcome to Three Pieces of Kit. We're starting a new gear review series this week, and I don't know if they'll be weekly, but I'm going to try. Got a lot on my plate, and I want to focus on giving you guys kit updates and gear reviews in under three minutes, and hopefully a couple of items at a time. How many of us do not like watching gear review videos where they focus on one thing, and it's a 20-minute video? I uh, had a challenge when I was in college. We had a speech class. And we were supposed to give a speech, and it had to last three minutes, and we didn't know what the topic of the speech was. It was just a random object, like a yellow number two pencil. So the teacher would give us an item, and we'd think about it for a few minutes, and then we'd have to get up in front of the class. Three minutes, sell me on why I need a number two yellow pencil. So I started thinking about that little crazy class I had to take, and I thought it was kind of fun. So I'm going to try to give you guys three pieces of kit in under three minutes, and subsequently this video today is going to focus on threes as well. The first one, how many of you guys make char cloth? How many of you guys are having a hard time looking for dry tinder in the woods? With winter coming in uh, North Carolina, the Smoky Mountains, Appalachian Trail, we get a lot of rain. We have a annual rainfall of over eight feet a year. You know how hard it is to find tinder that's dry? 300 fires with these premium cotton rounds. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your Altoids tin you're going to fold these like a taco, put them in the tin, and then cook them in the fire, and these will make awesome char cloth for you. So if you guys are using either a, a ferro rod or a flint and steel, this right here, excellent. Six or seven bucks, I think. Next item. How many of you guys hate sitting on a wet ground? I've had these chairs. I Actually, I keep one in my survival bus as a shower stool. Now, they say that the weight limit on these will support around 240 to 250 pounds. I guess what I could do is uh, sit on this and then maybe get Mountain Dew to sit on my lap. <laughs> but these chairs are super lightweight, super lightweight, 13 ounces, and that includes the bag, okay? And they set up pretty quick. And I've actually used this one numerous times. How about that? Lightweight, collapsible. Now it is aluminum. I will caution you. This is not going to be the most comfortable chair in the world, but it's it's better than sitting on the ground or sitting on a wet log. Last item. How many of you guys are making campfires and boiling water and cooking and struggling with a kit that will do everything? everything in under three minutes. Three minutes! Here it is, right here. You want to boil water? This is called the Kelly Kettle, and this is the Scout model. I actually have the Base Camp model as well, which is a lot bigger. This thing is absolutely amazing, and you just fuel the stove with whatever tinder you can find. Pine cones, twigs, sticks, any little thing put it in there. It's got a hollow well and it's double wall cylinder. You're going to pour your water inside of this hole right here and light it on fire. Awesome piece of kit. I've got two of these. These work really, really well. I got to get back to sharpening my knife. So thanks for stopping by. I'll, I'll see you next time.